How's it going guys? So today, uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how to create a Tumblr blog. Because um, I know there's a handful of people out there who are looking for a platform to start a blog on. And hopefully this video will help you on your endeavors to finding a useful platform. So let's go ahead and get started. So I'm going to go ahead and so first things first, you need to open up your web browser and go to tumblr.com and when you get to the page you'll see a uh, little box to sign sign up. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Um, okay, so we're going to go to type in my email and I will pick a password. And now a username. Well, I didn't know that Tumblr did that now. Okay, so we're going to pick um Yes, we're just gonna do this. And we're going to now hit sign up after we how old am I? I am actually. Yes, I have under read, understand, and agree to the Tumblr terms of service because we never actually read those. Let's be honest. Almost done. I am not a robot. I am human because I'm sitting here talking to you, and I have fingers that aren't mechanical. Select all the food. Okay. Um. Well. I am not a robot, I swear! <laughs> Why was that so complicated? <laughs> nice to know you're looking out for my safety. Alright, then you'd pick some things you're interested in, but for the sake of time of this video, I'm gonna just, just skip everything. Alright, this is your Tumblr dashboard. And so one quick thing, they will need to verify your email address. So you'll come over to your email. And I'm going to refresh this. Hello. Verify. And we'll wait for that to be verified. Okay then. Oh gee, thanks. And then they also suggested download the app, and it's. I would suggest that you do that. It's a very useful app. Um, yeah. Okay, so we're gonna refresh this, and now we can post a text post. And post. We now have one post. But Tumblr is a great platform you can do text post, photo post, quote, uh, set up a quotes or a series of quotes to say if there's a conversation you want to quote, you can do that. You can share links, and help chat is more of the quote. Anyway, chat, you can share an audio post, um, whether it's something you upload or from SoundCloud. You can share a video, whether it be something you upload or something from the internet, and this is going to be your easier option because I've heard of people up trying to upload stuff to Tumblr and it takes a while, but I've honestly never uploaded a video to Tumblr system, so I wouldn't specifically know that. So, let's go ahead and edit our uh, blog settings. Yes, that's, I want to do the thing. Okay, here we can up, uh, change our picture. That's not what, no, edit appearance. <laughs> edit your picture. I'm not going to do this now, but yeah, that's where you click. And change the name of your blog here for your mobile theme. Change the color of it. You can change the font. Change your background and whatnot. It's all there and then you just hit save. So it's honestly as simple as that, I mean, <coughs> the themes aren't all that hard, 
um, that this is where we'll go to change our theme and edit it, and I'll get into that pretty shortly, really soon. You can allow people to ask you questions, um, allow anonymous questions. You can let people submit posts to your blog, but I personally do not like that. You can have it automatically post things that you have queued up between, a, and it'll post between that time and that time, and you have it connect to your Facebook and Twitter for it to automatically share to those social media. And then there's all these other settings, and if you say, say if you want it to be a personal blog, you can maybe not have it show up in search results, and say if you wanted it, if you had it that kind of blog, you could enable that. Um, yeah. So let's go ahead and edit our theme. <coughs> Each kind of theme will be different. This is the basic theme that Tumblr gives you right when you sign up. Uh, so here you'll be able to give your title, you'll be able to give your blog a description. Hello there, and welcome to my temporary blog. Temporary blog for tutorial purposes. I again can't spell. Okay. So this is what happens to show up with this particular theme. I'm going to hit save because it will at least save the description. Now there are more themes that you can get for free. Some will cost money, but these are the themes that available has to offer. But you can click search way more themes, and it'll take you to. Um, Tumblr's theme garden, whatever they call it now. Um, and if you do a quick Google search online, you can usually find other types of Tumblr themes. Um, like one place to get some themes is, uh, I believe it's the theme guide. Yes, theme guide is one place. Now this place has some good themes as well, but all of these are ones you'll have to pay for. But yeah. So those are just a few other places to uh, find s some decent themes. Uh, most all of these should be free unless you click on one and it says that you have to buy it. But anyway, so those are your places, some places where you can get a theme. Um, I'm going to go ahead and change my th the theme on this blog to... Okay, I'm just going to come over here. As I know this is a good example of uh, how each theme is different. So I'm going to hit use and there will be a lot of different ways you can customize it. You can change the colors, you can add a logo it will show up at the top. Nope, logo will be your avatar. Nope, avatar. I swear I know what I'm talking about. Uh, you can have an image be your background. Um, have an image be a banner, or if you have a large sidebar portrait, you can add that. Um, and this one is extremely customizable because you can change the width of your content, um, have the blog title be in the sidebar instead of in the top bar. Align the top menu left. Yet yeah, each theme will be different, and you'll just have to play around with the theme that you get. This one has a lot of things that you can insert a Instagram feed, a Twitter feed, um, and a bunch of your Skype usernames. And here you can add pages. And when you first sign up, uh, you won't have as many different uh, page layouts. But once your blog is a few days old, I think it takes maybe a week, uh, and then you'll have a few more different page options. You'll have like a redirect page option. Um, I think that's the only other kind there is. So we're just going to set up a about page. And save. <clears throat> so that, and then once you make your changes, make sure you hit save. And that is a major that's essentially how you set up a Tumblr blog. Uh, 
Uh, and then you can here it is. And then you can get a little more complicated by and Tumblr allows you to edit the code itself. So say you want to add your own picture somewhere in the sidebar, you can, even though that's not an option in the themes settings. But if you're someone who knows how to do a little bit of coding, then you're in luck because you can edit it to however you want. So otherwise, that's essentially how you set up a Tumblr blog and what you decide to do with your blog is entirely up to you whether you turn it into a photo blog or a video blog home um, or a blog where you actually take time to write things so yeah that's entirely up to you and that is how you set up a Tumblr blog and I hope Tumblr now seems a little less scary and that you consider joining. Uh, if you want to follow me on Tumblr, my Tumblr is joshshorely.tumblr.com. The link to my blog will be down in the description, and I will see you guys next time.